Hey queens! Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about my clean girl wardrobe essentials. My friend Cindy did this and I literally loved it so much and I thought it was such a good video idea because I always do like autumn essentials, winter essentials. I thought I'd do a clean girl one because I love dressing clean and in my other video I talked about dressing clean when I did my how to become a clean girl, how to achieve the clean girl look. I talked about dressing clean and I feel like to go more in depth of it probably makes more sense. So we're going to start with tops. I feel like tops need to be basic. With a basic top you can make an outfit look good because it will just go with anything. Like today I'm wearing a basic top, a basic bolero. Is that what it's called? I think it's called a bolero. Bolero. Why did I just call it a bolero? That's so embarrassing. With some joggers, but they have this pink on it. But I think it doesn't look bad because I'm wearing a plain top. Do you know what I mean? If I was wearing a blue top, it might look a bit weird. But where it's like neutral colours, that's another thing. Neutral colours. Clean girls wear neutral colours. You can wear colours. It honestly is personal preference because certain people suit certain colours. But my preference is to wear neutral colours. I actually don't have any coloured clothes anymore. I got rid of them all the other day. Which is kind of embarrassing because if someone says, do you have an orange top? I'm like, no. Do you have a blue top? No. Like, I actually have no colours in my wardrobe now. Apart from, I have a blue tracksuit and then obviously I have, like, blue denim jeans and a blue denim jacket. They are literally the only colours I have in my wardrobe. Starting off with this little racer top from Lounge. I actually haven't worn this yet, as you can tell. But I only got it a few weeks ago and then I went away so I haven't actually had a chance to wear it. I think this with like smart work trousers, you know the ones I mean? I don't even know how to explain them, I really want to buy some though. I saw Sophia wear them, Sophia and Chintia, Sophia, and she was wearing like a racer top with these trousers and she looked so cool. And it has this little detailing on the back which says lounge, which I think is so cute. I'm obsessed with this colour. I don't really like racer tops though because I think my shoulders are really broad. That might just be me. I don't know. I need to get into them though. I think in spring I'm going to start wearing them more. Then just the plain Zara little crop tops. I think the material of these are so nice. It's like a silky material. Is it silk? I don't even know how to explain this. It's such a nice material. They are such a nice fit. They're so hugging and they just make your figure look so good. It's the perfect crop. I think they're only really like eight pounds they're really good in price and they do so many colors this is in a medium which i'm quite surprised about i thought i would have got a small it's actually a medium probably because the small was too cropped but yeah i love this and i wore it all the time in like summer and spring which goes with everything then moving on to like long sleeve tops i've got this long sleeve from cotton on it's kind of like a similar neckline to this one what would you call that is it a scoop neck I think that neckline is actually inside out. I think that neckline's really nice and it's also got like a ribbed material. I always wear this on TikTok and get so many questions where it's from. Everyone just loves how it fits. It's tight, makes you look good. It looks so good. I love this top so much. I need to get it in white and black as well because the fit of it is perfect. And it, they're actually very affordable. Then another long sleeve top is this black one from White Fox. These are the best skimmed dupe you will ever find. They are a bit pricey. I think they're like £30 a top, but if you think you're going to wear it more times than you pay for it. If you pay a pound every time you pay for it, you're going to wear it more than 30 times. I think they're so good. The material, the quality, the way it fits. I love these tops so much. I got one from Shein the other day and it's unmatched. It's so baggy on the arms. Like these just fit perfectly and I also have it in white and I also have it in grey and brown and I kind of want to get the pink one now because I don't like the Shein fit and I just love the fit of these ones they just fit so perfectly they're such a staple piece as well like basic long sleeve tops go with everything same with the crop tops basic little tops just go with everything I'm moving on to trousers I never used to be a skinny jeans girl since I was in school so for instance I was like 14 15 I've loved baggy trousers and I've never gone back but recently in the past year I've bought a few pairs of jeans from Zara I never thought Zara jeans would fit me well because I see them on girls on TikTok and I'm like I wish I had your figure I bought the Zara jeans Oh my god, they are perfect. They are a bit long, but I just cut the bottom of mine. They're very hit and miss because I have another pair that just aren't long at all, but they're the same size. It's weird. 
but I did actually cut the bottom of these ones. They are so creased, ignore that. Look at this blue color, like this is the most perfect blue color. I wanted a pair of jeans this blue color for so long. And I found these on the Zara website and I was like, I'll just order them. And they didn't fit me for the longest time. I just didn't like how they fit. And then I realized I just needed to cut the bottom and I wear these all the time. But the bottoms were already like frayed, so I think it doesn't look too weird. But these jeans are perfect, giving clean girl vibes. And I love how it's got this little like Zara tag on the back. I think that looks so cool. It reminds me of like Levi's jeans. They're more like skinny. They're not baggy, but they're not skinny. They're like tight on the waist and then they like go out a bit. Kind of like mum jeans. I love the fit of them. Another pair of Zara jeans, obviously. They're all I wear now. I got rid of all my old jeans the other day and I only have three jeans left and they're all from Zara. These ones also has the thing on the back, which I love. And this colour, I don't even know what this is. Is this black or like grey? They're like washed. And my boyfriend loves the washed look. Like he wants a pair himself. <laughs> I'm like, you can get these. These are the same fit. They're like skinny up top and then like baggy around the ankle. I love them but these ones I didn't have to cut like they just fit perfectly I went in to the Zara in Manchester I walked in I was with my friend and I saw them and I was like I'm getting them tried them on they literally fit perfectly then I think these trousers scream clean girl I don't know what it is I don't know if it's because they're like white but they're like linen trousers what the hell is that on the back of them Got like a black mark on them they need to get in the wash i am so grateful i bought these trousers you can wear them in spring summer and winter they are so cute i took them on holiday with me i've been wearing them through autumn and winter and they are so comfortable they are quite thin but they just oh, i love them they've got two little pockets at the back and it's like a drawstring it just fits so nicely and they go with everything like what can you not wear white linen trousers with they're giving mamma mia vibes these are from bershka as well i have tried to find them a few times but i think they're like always sold out but i will try link them in the description for you guys and then obviously a staple piece black joggers these ones are from lux to kill i just love this black like it's like jet black and it says hair i don't know if you can see it, it says lux to kill hair no, it doesn't. It says movement. They are from Lux to Kill though. These are like cuffed at the bottom. I don't know if I like cuffed joggers. I do. I don't know. Such a staple piece to wear with like black hoodies, like just a little black top. You can just wear black joggers with anything. And then obviously grey joggers, black and grey joggers. I've always worn them. I will never not wear them. I know things come in and out of fashion, but joggers will always be in fashion. And I love these grey ones. These are from Pretty Little Thing. And I wear these with my cotton on grey top that I showed you at the beginning. And people always think it's a set because they're like the perfect grey. Like they match each other so well. These are so comfy. Love these. And then also the ones I'm wearing right now. White box joggers. Just any joggers to be honest. Are such a clean girl vibe. Tracksuits are just giving clean. I don't know why. They just are matching tracksuits. Are so clean. Then talking about tracksuits. I've got this white fox hoodie. Which obviously goes with these joggers that I'm wearing and I love wearing these two together like when I leave the house I feel like I've put so much effort into my outfit but I haven't I've just chucked a tracksuit on white fox tracksuits they are perfect they fit so nice they are very expensive but if it's Christmas or your birthday ask for one or save up for one because they are worth it I have the white fox tracksuits in honestly every colour at this point this is my favourite one though this one's just giving croquette. Is it croquette? Someone commented on my TikTok yesterday, I'm giving croquette girl vibes, but I love that. My friend on TikTok, her name's Leah Roberts, and she gives me croquette girl vibes so much. I don't know what it is. She's always wearing like little pink things. Like it's just, it's like, it's like bows and like flowers, like pink is just such a girly color, you know? And then I also have this hoodie from Lux to Kill, which I get so many questions on. I think it's the fit of the hoodie because the hood is so perfect and it just sits so nicely. And the color's actually really nice as well. But I get so many questions on whether this one's from Lux to Kill. Every time I wear this as well, people are like, you look so clean. I don't know what it is. I think it's just like such a nice gray color. It just looks, 
I think hoodies that just have all one colour just look so clean and put together. How many times am I going to say put together? I did this on my other video. I need to drink my tea before it goes cold. Then on to like jackets. I've got this Bolero. Is it called a Bolero? Am I saying it right now? I've also got one on right now. It's like a little, it's honestly just sleeves. But it just adds so much to an outfit I think. And I also have it in black. I feel like you can't really tell with the black one because... You can't see the ribbed on it, but they're both from White Fox. And I'm obsessed with these. They add to an outfit so much. Just look so clean, so put together. And I have this jacket from Pretty Little Thing. It's just a little puffer coat. And this screams clean. I don't know why, but white colours and like cream colours just feel so clean to me. Don't get me wrong, I love my black North Face, but this just feels more put together it screams clean but then it's got makeup all over it like can i shut up but i actually got this from pretty little thing a few years ago so i don't know if it's still in stock it's got makeup all over it how am i even saying this is a clean jacket right now because it's not it's not clean last of all for jackets i have this little cropped trench coat i love this so much i don't wear it enough i need to wear it more it's also from pretty little thing it's still got the bloody label in it i mean I have worn it. I don't know why the label's in it. Oh my god, it smells like me. That's weird. Yeah, this I think this is perfect to wear with little jeans or anything really. Like it's such a put together outfit instead of wearing like a really long trench coat. I just feel like this is more. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Moving on to bags, I have this Christian Dior dupe. It's not real. I think it was like a hundred pound, but this is really good quality. And I love this because it's so plain and it goes with every outfit. And I saw a girl wear it once when I was like shopping. And I was like, I need that in my life. It just looks expensive as well. I mean, it is. It was £100. That's the most money I've ever spent on a bag. But I love this. Clean girl. And then this is the last bag. I only have two bags. My other bag's at my boyfriend's. I do have another one, but it's not really clean girl. I love this. I got this a few years ago. This is also fake. This was £20. But this just goes with every outfit again. Like, goes in my outfit right now. I just love the beige colours. These shoes are perfect. I don't wear them enough. I have another pair of these in a pinky colour. But look at them. They are so cute. They go with everything as well. These are, I don't actually know the name of these. I'll put it on the screen. Adidas, obviously. I think they're Ad Adidas Zeros. Like, zero, zero. I think that's what they're called. Yeah, love these. Love the colour. Love the neutral colour. As you can tell the whole way through this, everything I've shown you is either grey, white, or black. And these Uggs, I feel kind of bad, like, saying everything's fake. She's a fake girl. But these Uggs are fake. They were also £20 from Sarma. I love these so much. They're so comfortable. I do just wear them around my boyfriend's uni house because they're cute and they're comfy. I don't really wear them out. I mean, I have worn them out, but I don't really want them to get ruined. She got like a stain on them. I don't know if you guys can see that. But perfect little cute shoes and then last of all these are my babies i've had these since august i feel like i've influenced so many people to get these as you should every time i wear them i like fall over in them so i wouldn't wear them out of the house i just wear them as slippers but if you're in your house and you want to look clean and put together get some really cute slippers and then wearing that with a tracksuit and your hair like back oh, perfect i hope this helped you guys get a few little fashion tips on how to look clean because i've always struggled with like what outfits i want to wear but recently i've really got into fashion a lot of people are saying like oh she's such a clean girl so i just want to like help everyone else look to look clean do you know what i mean love you queens bye